Toto Timbers adamant it'll happen and there's every indication he could be right. There will soon be a winner coming from the Gary Player class. Games are improving, guys are knocking on the door. They've been back to the world of golf for the final boot camp of the year. A further step to realising dreams. There's realism, but positivity. It's been, I would say for me, it's been a bit average. I had a few good finishes in the big easy events. But obviously, lots of positives. I've been working on quite a few things. So um, I think if I look at the changes that I've made, I'm definitely moving in the, the right direction, obviously, with the summer two events coming. So I'll be excited for what's coming ahead. The boot camp has helped me a lot uh, in terms of game as well, because uh, some of the tournaments I couldn't go, but uh, because of boot camp that was organized by Gary Player and all the management, I could go. And uh, the way of thinking as well on tournaments, it has helped, because when you're on the boot camp, uh, you, may, you meet uh, different people. Uh, that helps you on mentally, it was Theo, and then cost management, we had coaches here that have been helping us. So um, everything that I've done on the boot camp, um, I took it to the golf course and it's working and things are just going according to the plan. I think we're fortunate that we have this group, I call them the Springboks. Hopefully we can get our first co sanction win or the win for on the Sunshine Tour. Um, yeah, so it's important, like, for me, Heinrich, um, Derek, all the other guys, Toto, just getting to know a guy like James Kampe, sharing his experiences with us, what he did when he was winning. Um, it's so important to get inside Omar Sanders, playing Alpha Daniel, leading against big guys. So he, the ideas he's sharing with us, so important. It's just over a year since Jack Wynn won the Big Easy Tour Championship and with it the Order of Merit and his place on the Sunshine Tour. It's been quite a tough learning experience. We still have a couple of tournaments, so obviously the goal will be to get the win um, and just improve as a person. Obviously when you improve as a person you can play better golf. I'm not so focused on the golfing side at the moment, it's more internally putting in processes, systems and then just taking it to the next level, playing consistent good golf. And then obviously you want to go to Europe and as you see, saw now Zander winning Q School, congratulations to him, fantastic player. Um, so that's the next step, obviously Europe, you can even go on the Asian Tour because it's try sanction so there's a lot of opportunities for the guys, so hopefully I can take my opportunity. The year may be ending, but there's plenty of the season remaining to do just that, and to make sure he retains a place on tour for the next year. There's a desire from everyone in the Gary Player class to perform on the bigger stages. I think it's also just the way you look at it. I feel when I play there, it's not as intense, so I'm not so serious. But, and then on the other side also, my belief is obviously a bit higher when I play in those events. So, if I can carry that over to the big events, I feel like I can make a, I can do some damage on the main door. Muziwalo Natunzwi has won at Glendower on the Big Easy. Of course, he too is looking at advancement. The future plans is just to see Muzi playing on the PGA Tour. That's my goal. I want to play on the highest level of this game. But at the moment now, we, um, I still have a few tournaments uh, up until the season ends. So I'm focusing more on this next event. But uh, Muzi wants to play on the PGA. Shoot for the moon, and if you miss, you will still be among the stars. There are stars in the Gary Player class of 2018, and they're all shooting resolutely for success.